Well, on a roll and able to pick up every star in the past seven consecutive levels. When will that streak finally be broken and being on a roll and doing it really quickly? Last four videos I did do really quickly. We'll see in Mushroom Lore. Signs there with two stars in this level. It could happen. Let's go. Let's go right away. Even holding on to that arrow. Kind of scared that I would run into a Goomba or anything around here. Well, always tempted to break that streak, but it shall continue. At least, uh, at least as long as the exclamation marks do not cause too much trouble. But they're here to help, really. And is this pipe here to help? I'm just gonna talk to you. Yes. Hey Mario, I'm not like those other baddies. I gamble, I play games, I make money. Let's see how much coins you can collect. On your mark, get set, go! Whoa. One, two, three... Hey, That's pretty quick. I've got the pattern down, though. Sort of. And then I lose it. Great. Do I have to collect a certain number, though, before... before I can get a star? I wouldn't be surprised what could happen... Good job! Is that all there is to it? No star? I hope that's all there was to it. I didn't really need the coins, I just need to play a little bit of a game. Of course, gambling has its risks. As does this, I think. I can't go across that, it blocks me out. But, does it do anything worse? Probably not, I think I'm okay there. What do we have now, besides Chuck and Trouble? What if I go up this? Did I do that a bit too early? Hmm, well, we'll see. Back to playing like we're in a Super Mario World hack one more time, as I think I can hear in the music. Oh! And I want to go down this. I could go down this. Actually, I can't. Even though we were in the sky and it was very convincing. Of course, it could be just as convincing that we could go up that, but that doesn't work either. Talk. Can I even read the sign? Why not? I want to be able to walk, but I'm stuck walking that bridge. I can't go on the cloud. Okay. Watch out. Shell trouble again. And I ruined somebody's game. Okay, run. Well, time to switch back to Tanuki. You asked for it. And I don't even need to use this springboard. Even with a regular leaf. I could have done it. Oh, oh. And let's just let go of this. So, that's what we have instead of a star. But now as for the other one. Guess I should continue. And the other point. You gonna be a clever one with this? Alright, fly like a fairy. It's probably for the other star. Maybe not. Wait, wait. What? What's the big idea now? Let's just land. Something could happen. Why do we have the exclamation mark now? Oh! Is this just for the coins? Anything on the other side? Probably nope. Well, try this if we can hurry for something. Yeah, nothing. Just continuing on. And because of what it looks like right now, this is probably going to be for the normal star. I'm guessing I got the secret star. We'll have something in here too. Just more money, more riches, less chomp to bounce off of because you can't bounce off him at all. All those exclamation marks, and yet it's not quite that dangerous. Not like Bonsai Bill dangerous. I could make it that soon if I die, because it's going to be basically the same results. Like jumping onto a spiny, those kinds of results. Oh, goodbye, Hammer Brother. One more of those goodbyes. Have to press the green switch. 
shouldn't have shouldn't have tried to back up there. <sighs> when backing up backfires. I always hate that. Ooh. But I'm taking this. I'm pressing I'm gonna hit this soon. Go back, chomp. Go back, chomp. There. Can't take this with me, though. Stay up there, bat. You listen, and you shall live. For a few seconds longer, anyway, because I'm not going to be near you. And let's take this before we see what's going to be the power-up inside here. If any power-up at all. There's gotta be. Still nothing. Maybe just a little bit later, though. Run. Run, you're doing fine. Am I going to need a springboard for that? I wondered what I would need for this, but it's just a Mega Mole. Okay, and... What is with this? You can't regular jump off of them, otherwise you get hurt, but you can spin jump and destroy them. That still confuses me, but since it's a spin jump, and there's some sort of drill aspect to it, I really should be able to accept it. Yeah, maybe I will accept it. Again, for a few seconds. That moon's not really worth it right now. That spin jump wasn't worth it either. All this. Now as we head back, let's slide. Let's not regret this slide. Here we go. Seriously, what's, what is with all those exclamation marks? Probably pitfalls like this. Back to the challenge of waiting for this platform to sync up with the other one. I may have to scroll off like this in order for them to do that. What, just what I want. So you can't... There we go, finally! What was the problem there? Okay, okay. That was quite a wide gap. At least this one worked out. Another one should work out, too. Depending on if I see that one. There it is! A spin jump, and we are good. Another spin jump, we should be even better. Okay. There we go, got that. Back to the cape, but not exactly acting like a cape. That's okay, though. Mario looks weird when he does that. He looks even weirder. He looked so weird that I just had to lose it. It's probably for the better that I lost it, too. There may be something better later on. Come on. Gotcha. I'll get you, too. And I'll get what's in here. Slowly recover my way to 99 again. Uh, hello? Eek! It's the red hat again! Rascals, round up all the ammunition you can get. You are going down, Red Hat. Eek. <laughs> wow. Fall back. One of our people have died. Oh, the horror. I'm not pressing pause right now. But pressing pause... Uh, actually doing that apparently fixed it. <sighs> Whatever I set for my start button, it acted up. Something happened. Alas, you have returned, Mario. Yes, indeed, you have returned. The princess and the Council of Six are awaiting your presence. Come in. Come in. Ooh, these statues look nice. Hello, Mario. Have you came for the meeting? Ah, right this way, please. Don't make the princess wait. You know how she is when she does. We gotta move on. Someone who's not so happy. Let me go ahead and rob this place. It's gonna be worth it in the end. I hope it is. Mario, get your stuff together and head straight down to the Royal Meeting Hall. I'll... I'll pay for someone else to do it. How's that sound? Probably not that good. Hey, Mario, I heard you beat Mar Wario the other day. Good job. Mario's his own worst enemy? I guess not. These are one of the Mushroom Kingdom's finest flowers. Handpicked one by one by the Mushroom Kingdom's finest flower rangers. Isn't this fantastic? I would say so. Hey, Mario, it's a me. Great imitation, don't you think? Hey, Mario, what's up? Okay. 
Quiet down, my people. Silence. Welcome, Mario. It's a pleasure to have you here at the 300th Annual Mushroom Kingdom Open House. It's been that long. Now, now, settle down, my lovely people, including Mario, who's ready to run. Things have only begun. First will come the new laws that will be passed, then we will elect new representatives for the Council of Six. After that, we will hold a party to honor those who have done great things. But first, we must see what Father has to say in his elegant dress of his. Okay, it's doing that pause thing again. Okay, this time I pressed pause and it didn't work. Any time now? Yes. This must just be a bug with cutscenes. Behold, my beauty knows no bound. Only an elite princess of class 3 like myself can use this technique. Hehe, <laughs> as you can see, the princess has learned all her advanced behaviors from me. Good luck, Mario, but her advanced skill are not in another castle. Although Princess Peach has obtained class 3 elite princess, she has not surpassed myself. Hehe, <laughs> as I am a legend. He is the greatest princess, don't you think? Take this, Mario. Only a princess of elite status can open this. Let us see your potential. Go, Princess Mario! You have opened the pretty princess box. Open the treasure from its side, and able to open it. Mario opens lid, and the room suddenly becomes dark. Huh? What is the idea? A strong sense of regret and freight fills the room. I wouldn't call those toads freight. <laughs> Suddenly, a glowing orb appears. I really can't handle that orb. Uh, oops. Oh, time to take revenge on the one that sealed me. Stop pausing. I am burning, sifting with rage, ready to kill at a moment's notice. Behold, the might of Ogura. Well, the might is not going to work quite like that if I have to keep pausing. Now, my first course of action. Oh, you want to know how I was sealed in? Grr, it makes me burn with a vengeful rage just thinking about it. Oh, the pain. Oh, the pain of trying to handle this. Long ago, I was assigned the task of destroying the castle of Puff Top. But I was defeated. I was defeated by a starfish. My memory is cloudy. I must remember... Well, I think the castle is disappearing now. Boy. Stop doing that to me. The prophecy. It was correct. Yes, I knew all along. Ogura couldn't be sealed forever, so I had to release him. You see, Mario, this was all a setup. Me and Peach made this whole arrangement up? Long ago, there lived a man who ruled the Mushroom Kingdom. He was a star, but not just your ordinary star. He was a starfish. He couldn't completely defeat his old archenemy, so he took away the one thing Ogura strived for the most. His freedom. But Ogura couldn't be sealed forever. Starfy knew that one day Ogura's influence would be able to escape the cage and cause massive damage to the outside world. He could use the prison as his refuge while he killed the world from the safety of his box. Starfy was frightened of such an outcome, so he gave the Star People the task of enlightening future descendants of the throne, with this knowledge. Mario, you must go after Ogura and slay him. In I'm sure Ogura cannot escape this castle, but it seems that the other that the Star People did not know the full capabilities of Ogura. Go, Mario! I'll take both of you. And I'll take another... Take all the mushrooms that I can. Part of another episode? Perhaps. I hope so, because I, I really want to see how that ends. Well, next time, Invasion on Destruction.